High school football hitting regional weekend. The best from Rochester in Section 5 taking on the best of Buffalo in Section 6. No class in our neck of the woods was as close as Class A, with several teams worthy of a sectional title. Arondequit won it on this last second touchdown last weekend. Tonight, Dan Fichter and his boys taking on West Seneca East in the Class A Regional. First quarter, no score. Eagles defense flying around. Liam Jones and Ronnie Garrow, big boys, with the sandwich for the QB sack. Ball actually came out. Aronquit recovered. That led to Freddie June doing Freddie June things. He scored the game winner last weekend. Snakes his way in to make it 8-0 Eagles. The rain never stopped in this game. Moved to the second quarter. Sean Dolak, grown man strength. Look at him rumbling in there. Bulls his way in. We were tied at eight at halftime. Third quarter after an Eagles turnover. Trojans punch it in. Devere Mathis just breaks the plane. 15-8 Eagles trailing. Came up with three huge stops in the fourth quarter, but Arondequoit couldn't capitalize. June sacked on fourth down in the final minute. Eagles suffer their first and only loss of the season, 15-8 in the Class A Regional. An icy field at Clarence High School for the Class C Regional. Letchworth Warsaw taking on Cleveland Hill. First quarter, Letsaw punting Aaron Waller. Trying to re return it, can't handle it. Zach Tucker falls on it. Let's with Warsaw in business. Couple plays later, that sets up Tom Sandura from a yard out. Indians down eight to six. Unfortunately, they wouldn't get any closer after that. Third quarter, Waller makes up for the muffed punt, takes the handoff around the edge, and into the Knights. Indians fall in the Class C Regional, 54 to six.